Hey everybody, I get to wear my short sleeves and my shorts, so excited. Today, we're gonna be talking about periodic water testing. Spring is the best time for you to do your periodic water testing. Although it's summer and your furnace is going to sit idle, do not drain the furnace of the water in proper water treatment. Always have your furnace full of properly treated water. The furnace must be turned off and cooled in order to take the water sample. Allow the furnace to cool until the water temperature is below 80 degrees. The next step is to remove the ash. Lightly scrape the inside of the firebox to remove any ash. Shut off power to the furnace and stop the pumps. Here is an important note. Make sure the ball valves to the pumps are in the open position to avoid any airlock upon restart. Never attempt to operate the pumps with the ball valves to the pumps in the closed position. If you have a forced air furnace, turn that thermostat off. In order to extract a water sample, you are going to need a hose. Attach the hose to the water jacket drain at the bottom of the furnace. This is located at the bottom of the furnace's water jacket barrel in the rear. Open the water jacket drain until the water runs clear and then close it. With a water sample bottle ready to fill, Open the water jacket drain again, fill the water sample bottle, then turn the power and the pump back on and return the furnace to service when ready. Now we've come to our last step. Your water treatment is gonna come in a box like this. Now what's important about this particular box other than your water treatment? You are also gonna find your water sample bottles. So, oof, you have your water treatment, obviously. But don't throw away this box because in this box you're also going to find your water, two water sample bottles. You're also going to find your label that you're going to fill out and place on your water sample bottle. Finally, you're going to find the box that you're going to send with your water sample in it. You do have to construct it yourself. We are going to take your water sample bottle that we just filled and what you'll do is you'll fill out your personal information, include your email address, and then stick this label onto the bottle. Also, it's not great to do water samples of, in Evian bottles, smart water bottles, you know, milk jugs. A water sample report will be returned to you via email. Here's an example of a water sample report. On every report, there will be an action to be taken. On this particular report, the treatment level is low. It will then direct the owner to how much water treatment will need to be added or if it's satisfactory. Here is an example of the ultimate goal, having your report say satisfactory. Okay folks, the reason why today is so important are these two little examples. Each of these bottles has a piece of steel. This first bottle has that steel in water without proper treatment. This second bottle has that same steel with proper water treatment. Can you see the difference? Which water would you rather have? I finally get to wear my shorts, no sleeves. I've been working out. I know you're jealous, you can tell. Does my second eye, my left eye look the right size as the other one? Because it seems to be more squinty. It looks fine. Is this good? That's good. Should I do it like this? <laughs> <laughs> and I like how he emphasizes <laughs> weird words. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, is it shooting right now? Yeah. Oh, whoops. Okay. Whoops. All right, so. I can see you. I can't see you. I can see you. I can't see you. This one, obviously.